So, I'm back. Yes, my 40 days are up. It has been the end of Lent, um, which means it's Easter. Hooray, and lots of Easter eggs, like my ones up there. I have three and I've already started cracking into them. Oops. Oh well. Um, Oh yeah, I started drinking tea again for some reason. I just kind of decided that maybe coffee isn't the best thing for me to drink. Considering I'm generally hyperactive anyway. So, anyway, in the 40 days that I have been not vlogging, I have done other stuff. Like, I've read books, I think. Well, I kind of nearly finished, and it's called The Name of the Star. Um, it's by Maureen Johnson, who is a nerd fighter. And, uh, yeah, I'm not going to spoil it for you, but it's a really good book. Uh, it's kept me on the edge of my seat. Also, I've been to see two films recently, which is The Muppets, and back to me. And the uh, Hunger Games, which I which I went to watch last night, which was quite interesting. Was it really predictable though? Like, it's a good film. I get it. I get the point of the film, but it's just a bit predictable. Like, you know, the storyline's good. Well, I'll, I'll tell you the storyline. I won't tell you the ending. But basically, uh, there's these twelve districts, and in the twelve districts, there is. Uh, they do this thing called the reaping, and twelve um, twelve pairs get picked from the twelve districts. Well, two people get picked from each district, a boy and a girl. And basically, there's these things called the Hunger Games, and basically what they have to do is fight each other to the death. And there can only be one victor, except in this one, the 74th annual Hunger Games, they decide to... Um, let two people win and then stop so they go no I'm gonna stop there good film I haven't read the books yet but what my friends have been telling me is like the books are so much better than the films but that's normally the case anyway this is my wall it's got specifically more stuff on it well not really more stuff well yeah more stuff uh, I stuck up a few pictures of me my mum my family on my wall uh, there's a bit of a cross as well one of my shout outs oh Spin. so that's three things off my list alright um okay band camp uh, I have a band camp of which I put music on because that's what a band camp is uh, no inspiration is actually on there you can buy that for a dollar which I think is about ATP I'd really like people to buy it because you know Okay, it's not going to get into the charts, but still, I'd love to sell my music. And that leads us quite nicely onto my next topic of... I've got a new song! I have a new song. It's called Indifference and... I needed to finish my tea for this. And um, I'm making a music video for it on Tuesday. Uh, I've got a list of people, and this is my planning board. Planning board. With it doesn't look like a lot of stuff, but that's important stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna give any spoilers away, but I will be doing a behind the scenes video of indifference. Um, but I have to thank someone. I have to thank my friend Bianca for singing and singing it, and I want to laugh at my friend Shabbat because she's volunteered. I haven't even told her what she's doing yet. I probably should do that today. But also, I'm directing it with Bradley. And, um... I have a blog as well. You can read that. I'll put a link in somewhere around here. I'll put a link to my bank account somewhere around here as well. Not in the same box, obviously. Shout out. Let's go to my main man, Saggers. Babble! Had a mental time at that party. Focus on Basil. Anyway, so now that's that, that's done. So, I just want to say, I'm back, baby!